my most practice I'd have to say is probably like my pitching wedge or my 46 degree. Yeah. Do a lot of bump and runs. Do you? Yeah, a lot. I've done a lot more in my older age. Yeah. Old man golf. It just seems smarter. Yeah, it's smart. It's high percentage. Yeah. The chances of screwing it up. I do all these like this. Like I would hardly ever play this shot. It yeah. It helps my hand yeah. get away from work. Yeah. I've been using power tools all day until I get to this. Yeah. Yeah, lots of bump and runs. I would say eight, nine, and pitching wedge are really good ones to practice. You know where it really helps a lot? Hit your pitching wedge and your nine iron to 40 yards. Yeah. That'll really sharpen your game up. Like right now, I'm using a nine. I hit nine about 140. Yeah. What is this, probably 50? 50, 60. About 60 yards, yeah. That'll really sharpen you up. That's really good. That's for amateurs to never do that. Yeah. Right. I wouldn't either. I, I would think, oh, you got to go with the club that, that's meant for the target. Yeah, no. That's not the case. You're exactly right. Yeah. Club up twice and swing softer, and you'll see how much closer you'll get to the, to the pin. I think it helps you, like, um, through your legs. Yeah. You know, you're, like, you got feel in all your clubs. Your feel, right. 100%. You'll develop a really nice feel. I played blues yesterday. We had one, 158 to the blue from the blue on number 16, and I used my 7 iron. I just hit a nice little easy knockdown shot, and I was playing with a guy, and, and I go, what'd you use? He, we both hit it within three feet, and he goes, I used a 9. And I go, I used a seven. And he goes, what? Why, why, why would you do that? It just feels good. It's easy. The club does the work. You know, a lot of times, too, they, well, you play at other places, like the fast green, you try to run to hit a putt. Yeah. It's kind of a soft landing shot. Yeah. You just go flying in there with a, it helps you, I think, with that. Right. Kind of look at it as if you had a mason jar and you fill it with golf balls and it looks full but it's not you can put sand in and it'll fill in and it looks full but it's not you can still put powder in and it looks full but it's not you can still pour water in and it'll still you know what i mean and and that's kind of clubbing up 